Okay, hi guys. Yeah, Bitcoin, huh? What a thing. This is my daily chart, guys. If you have been following me on Twitter, oh, this is me trying to make things easier. <laughs> okay, this is... I have changed my count so many times. And you can see here that I had this kind of ABC. I was trying to to hold. What, what, what I was trying to do? I was trying to make the case of this fifth wave here being here, being a truncated fifth. <clears throat> okay, I gave up. Why? Because the data, because the because the 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 price action, the the market showed me that I was wrong. Okay, that's it. We need to be humble and we need to just accept that sometimes that's it the, most of the time by the way yeah? most of the time we are not correct and we need to be prepared that's why we we are here to we are here to trade for we are not here to be rich in a one year we're here to be trading for 10 years we are here to be investing in crypto for 10, 20 years, if you really trust uh, crypto, the, the crypto concept, you need to be here for the, the, the long haul, okay? You won't be like just training to be rich in one year because that is the recipe for, <clears throat> for, uh, for a ch chance of being rich really, uh, really fast in uh, <laughs> and uh, frenetically but it's a recipe for failure statistically speaking <clears throat> you're gonna be a statistic that's what I don't want you to do that's what I don't want you to be okay personally I want to help the community okay that's what I want why I want that because it's important for me as well yeah <clears throat> I want people to be using crypto. I don't want this to be just a concept, to be just a beautiful thing, because it's beautiful, at least for me. <clears throat> okay, so I changed my count. I'm sorry for my, <laughs> for my my little disarray. <clears throat> <clears throat> so I, I was trying to make this as a, this is a truncated fifth because it looks like a truncated fifth for me. Okay. Um, but now I need to accept that we have a one here, two here, and a three here. Otherwise, we need to accept that the, a whole different thing, a uh, corrective structure here, okay? Which would mean that this count here, this is my daily count, okay, guys? is not what's happening. We are still going down. Not that I'm, I'm not saying that we, we finished correcting, but we are correcting, but we need to put in another high here a new local high we need to challenge this 10k okay we need to have an x here to finish this y to finally finish this wave two here and then uh, resume the wave three which is gonna be like next year okay let's be let's be realistic if this doesn't happen well let's assume that this doesn't happen i'm wrong okay that's what is beautiful about predicting, not predicting, I'm sorry, forecasting the marketing, the market. If you are wrong and you are like wrong within the, 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 within the, the, the framework that you're using, you're not going to lose a lot of money. You're not going to lose a bit of money, just a little bit. And then you're going to be able to reposition, to, 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 uh, to re-enter their market in a position that you're gonna make enough to to uh, make up for what you had lose, what you have lost, what you had lost. Sorry, okay. Now, that's what I think. Uh, my kind of uh, analysis is is that I am open to different scenarios. I'm open. I'm, I'm here. I'm open. If it goes down, I'm gonna stop loss here. I'm gonna starting short in it uh, the market is gonna tell us beforehand okay this is my daily count for the moment 
okay i have changed this count and i'm not gonna be uh stubborn and say hey i've never changed my count have you ever watched the the, the tv series house when they it, uh, when they are trying to find uh, a cure for a patient for a patient and they are trying a lot of th different things so this is a really good analogy this is what we do here so when you go to your doctor when you when you have an, a, a when you have a, a, a I don't know uh, perhaps some of you guys are uh, are doctors are uh, physicians and you know how uncertain you are when you are when you I'm talking about statistics you have um, uh, you have um, uh, how is that called uh, false negatives uh, false positives so you have all sorts of uncertainty in your profession yeah? even when you when you do an exam when you do a, a lab exam a, a test you know that it's not 100% certain and you are trying you are trying medicines yeah you are trying okay we are not sure we need to test that's what I do. That's what uh, I think. What that's what uh, we should be doing uh, when we are using the when we use when we are using the Elliott Wave principles. We need to be reactive to the market. So then we won't be like expecting the market to do what we want. Uh, we are like physicians testing expecting the reaction we need to expect the reaction to see if what we proposed is correct or not so why is why we are so um, open for uh, why we are so open when a physician changes his mind or her mind but we are not so open when a technical analysis when a technical analyst change his or her mind I am open to change my mind, of course, because this is not this is a dynamic system, guys. This is not a linear system. It's I'm sorry. This is open for debate. Okay, uh, if you come to my Twitter here and say, "Hey, you are wrong," I'm gonna be happy. I'm not gonna be angry, or I'm not, and I'm not gonna say, "Hey, okay, I'm wrong," but no, no, I'm sorry. I'm 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 not gonna say. I'm right, wait for it, I'm gonna prove to you, no, I'm gonna say, hey, show me, please, I might be wrong, of course, I'm expecting it, okay, so I think I was wrong when I said that I, we had a truncated fifth, I was, I was more or less expecting it, but, and then we have, let me show you guys why I, I, I decided, right, I, I have said that in a previous video that if we if we um, be traced to a certain level which is this level here I would reconsider my count and that's what I'm doing now okay this is a one two three okay now we don't have a problem of a of an extended one if you have watched my other videos I was expecting a, a fixed fifth wave here because of that so here is my my projection here and I'm gonna take this out so here our fifth can be our fifth wave our last wave in our first wave of the minute this is our X up there our first wave here this is gonna be our decisive wave minute okay this is our last wave this is gonna be our first wave of this motive impulse wave okay that is gonna finish this X here the way I'm proposing here, okay? I might be wrong, this might go way up and we don't have an X, okay? This, the correction might end here. Simple like that. But I think we need more time to finish this correction. So I'm proposing a Y here. Again, this doesn't change a lot. If you are following the market and you are acting accordingly, you don't need to be afraid Okay, you just need to act, you just need to react to the market and adjust your positions. So this is my one hour chart, again, we broke the support that I have, uh, this was about 50% from the retracement 
the swing swing uh, the retracement tool here from the top to the bottom here okay we have the 50 percent we broke the support okay we broke it with confidence and we are now testing new lows we are now 7700 here we have this the 100 percent of this a b c that i proposed let me zoom this I propose again it's a wave three not a problem it's a wave three <clears throat> a simple correction a rather extended correction right but I'm not proposing a W X Y or an ABCD but a simple a sharp correction here for our way a, a B C D okay a, a rare uh, extended correction for our B which is according to the alternate guideline what we would expect so a b is a bit more complex and our d okay our d would be like this messy thing one this really strange one two and then we have our three here okay let's measure to see if our one here is the same length of the wave of what i propose to be our wave three yes it's almost 127 percent so it's okay right so we here we have a one let me label it huh? for our last wave okay this is our one two three then they're gonna have a four probably this was a support is gonna act as a resistance then we are gonna go here to this this is what we have this is where i think we're gonna land the 127 percent okay here we have a confluence okay 127 percent of uh here we have uh, the 127 percent 20 percent okay for our a b the extension of a through b we have this wave c for our fourth wave we are halfway to through the 50 percent and here we have our previous i'm sorry <clears throat> the fourth wave of a lower degree which is as a gal as a elliott wave principal guideline the uh, a good place for a retracement yeah when we have a this four okay let me review it this fourth wave here of a higher degree we, we trace us to the previous to the region of the the wave of the four of the of a lower degree so <clears throat> this region here okay this region here where we have this cluster here this is the region that i'm looking for <clears throat> oopsie okay this is the region that i'm looking for we have a support there of course we have a support i mark the support there Oops, see okay so not difficult right not difficult to play this at all we have here the 50 percent for our target of the fourth wave and we are going up okay we're going up after that so we are not far from finished this wave four we are not we need a little bit we are gonna now we are starting to pull back a bit for the fourth wave to test the support now acting as a resistance yeah now acting as a resistance and then um we are we are test this again and then we are going down once more to get to this 38 20 percent or 50 percent perhaps lower okay that's what i'm expecting so i'm gonna move those targets here those green targets here i'm gonna move a bit lower those are my targets okay perhaps one here yes this is good one here okay dollar cost average guys i'm averaging my buys i'm buying since there since here but i'm not buying a lot i'm buying 10 percent and i'm patient i'm 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 like an investor i'm i'm buying and i'm looking for the best price i'm not really day daily training i'm this is not my style okay this is what i'm waiting i'm waiting for a good price here then when i am in a profit i'm gonna sell it 
And then I'm gonna do this whole process again. Okay, it's simple. I know that the overall direction is up. I know. I might be wrong, yes, but I have stop losses. But at the end of the day, when this is going down, I'm not desperate and I'm not going to lose and FOMO and say, oh my goodness, I was wrong and then I need to be right. No, you don't need to be right, guys. This is, I'm sorry, this is the opposite of a good practice, okay? You actually, you need to be consistent with what you do. If you use, um, if you are drawing your lines, here your train lines, if you use alert waves, try to be within the alert wave principle, not breaking all the rules. I'm sorry, not breaking any rules. If you are going to allow for something, you need to be consistent. You need to, to see and go and look for the data and go for the, uh, and look for uh, different places to see if you, if what you are doing is correct, okay? Don't trust your instincts because most of the time you are wrong, okay? And um, I think that, that this is pretty much what's gonna happen, guys. I don't think we, I was completely wrong. I'm gonna show you guys, I was counting. See, this, is, this is, was my fourth and then we have a truncated fifth and this is about my third we would be going to our 61865 here this is not okay for our fourth wave okay now i changed my count okay i'm testing i'm trying okay that's why we do that we we, we are trying to to we, we, no one no one knows the truth then no one knows the truth of course but no one knows the future i'm not a fortune teller here I'm not a future teller. I'm a, a forecaster. Uh, if you allow me to say that, okay? I'm, a, I'm not even a, a forecaster. I am. I'm something like more than a, 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 a... I like to say that I am giving you guys polite guesses. What I think is going to happen, but I might turn out to be totally wrong. And, and I... And I know that I'm playing as you guys are playing with me or not. I am playing this this whole thing about this whole Bitcoin thing together with you guys. And I'm learning. If you guys tell me something, if you guys give me a feedback, I'm going to always be listening. Okay. Uh, this was a sh rather short video. I think we have pretty much of action. And we need to be now uh, paying attention at all the the movements and what's gonna happen next. Uh, we are pulling back after this huge dump. Okay. Thanks for watch, and uh, follow me on Twitter to to keep updated. If you like my content, if you think that I am not <laughs> uh, the best, you, you are. You don't need to follow me. <laughs> not follow, but subscribe to me. But follow me on Twitter <laughs> okay uh, I'm really happy that you guys are supporting me and thanks for watching again again always enjoy your trades always always this is this is what it, this is what life is about guys okay bye bye cheers <laughs>